What's up creators, this is Dan with Webaround Gaming and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up your Webaround green screen with OBS Studio. The whole process will take about a minute and will require some additional tweaking based on your lighting and environment. Let's do it. To start, open OBS Studio and navigate to the sources box. This is where we're going to be adding a camera source. Right click in the box and hover over add. This will open a larger menu of available sources and we're going to be selecting video capture device from this list. A window will pop up asking us if we want to select an already configured video capture device or create a new one. We're going to be starting fresh, so select create new and name the source to your choosing. Remember that your sources are going to be pretty extensive, so name it something cool like your breathtaking cam or, you know, like webcam if you want to be a square. Once you click OK, the device settings menu will open up where you can adjust all the other camera settings. You can tweak these settings at a later time, but for now, let's navigate to the device drop down and select your camera. That black box should now be showing your awesome face and you are all set. Oh, hey there Dan. As I mentioned before, you can use this menu to adjust the FPS, resolution, and other settings. When you're done, click OK. Awesome. Now to add a chroma key filter. This is what will turn your green background transparent, kind of like a weatherman. Let's navigate back to your camera and this time, right click on the camera source. We're going to be selecting filters, which will open up, you guessed it, the filters menu. Let's move to the effects filter box, right click inside of it, hover over add, and then select chroma key. And just like that, we're on the chroma key filter adjustment window. Here's where you're going to be adjusting all your chroma key settings. As I mentioned before, everyone's settings will be different based on the lighting and environment that you're creating content in. So take some time to tweak each setting so that the background is transparent, but that you aren't chroma out either. And that's it. You have now successfully added your Weber on green screen to your arsenal of content tools. Congratulations. For any further questions about your Webaround green screen and how to set it up with OBS Studio, feel free to drop us a line and email, pop into our Discord channel, or hit us up on Twitter. All the links are down below. Thank you so much for watching and happy creating.